Good evening, guys. How are you doing today? Good evening. <clears throat> Can you listen to me? Yeah. Good evening, okay, teacher. good evening. How are you? Okay, in this night, we are going to start with our class for today. It's a pleasure to me to be here. So, and right now, we are going to learn about new topic for today. Okay, guys, just give me one second for a while because I need to share my screen with you. So... Can you see my screen? Yes. Yes, can you see my screen? Pueden ver mi pantalla? Sí. Yeah. Okay, excellent. Thank you. Thank you for letting me know. Okay, as you know, okay, what do you remember from yesterday? ¿Qué recuerdas sobre la clase de ayer? Let's see. ¿Qué recuerdan sobre la clase del día de ayer? I remember teacher uh, practice. Mm -hmm. What else? You mean? What else? ¿Qué más? Mm -hmm. What else? What else? I don't remember. <laughs> Solamente recuerdan. Vaya pues. Muy bien. Yes, we're talking about, se recuerda que hicimos un reading, yes? The reading, ¿qué más hicimos? Hicimos el reading, luego we're talking about different countries, ok? Estuvimos hablando sobre las diferentes actividades. Muy bien. Bueno, vamos a empezar en this night. ¿Y qué ven en pantalla? ¿Qué ven en pantalla? Infinity complement. Infinity complement. Very good. ¿Y cuáles serán los infinity complement? Ok, vamos a ver entonces. ¿Qué serán? Lo voy a acercar un poquito más para que lo vayamos entendiendo y viendo. Muy bien. Bueno. Um, okay, aquí está. What should do for a call? Okay, infinity. Vamos a ver un video right now. Para, ahorita acá solo tenemos el infinity complements, pero ¿qué es eso? How, what is this one and how we can use that? Right now, I'm going to share with you a video. Mientras tanto, también doy como el espacio para que los demás alumnos ingresen, ¿verdad? Ya que yo sé que ingresé un poquito temprano a la clase, pero recuerden que la lista se pasa siempre 10 minutos después. Ok, muy bien. So, right now, I need that you have to pay attention. Que usted ahí ponga su, toda su atención. Because we are going to start a study about infinity complements and how we can use that and how we can practice with them and so on. We do um, listen the video, please let me know. Voy a ver si se escucha, me hacen saber. Okay. Hi, in this session. Do you listen that? Yes, I listen. Okay, thank you. Infinitive complements will be taught. Infinitive complements are used to ask and give advice. I will give you a quick example right now. What should I do for a cold? It's a good idea to take some vitamin C. And stay with us and join the explanation after the audio program. Infinitive complements. What should you do for a cold? It's important to get a lot of rest. It's sometimes helpful to eat garlic soup. It's a good idea to take some vitamin C. Remember when we talk about infinitives, we refer to a verb with no conjugation. So notice that we use 
to plus verb with inner suggestions or advice. So if you want to give an advice to someone, you should do it this way. It is helpful to go to the doctor. It is important to drink lots of water. It's a good idea to take cough drops. Okay, we are going to watch for the second time and after that I'm going to ask you to you how it's, uh, it can use an infinity complement and what is an infinity complement, okay? Just this is the last time, please pay attention. Hi, in this session, infinitive complements will be taught. Infinitive complements are used to ask and give advice. I will give you a quick example right now. What should I do for a cold? It's a good idea to take some vitamin C. And stay with us and join the explanation after the audio program. Infinitive compliments. What should you do for a cold? It's important to get a lot of rest. It's sometimes helpful to eat garlic soup. It's a good idea to take some vitamin C. Remember when we talk about infinitives, we refer to a verb with no conjugation. So notice that we use to plus verb within our suggestions or advice. So if you want to give an advice to someone, you should do it this way. It is helpful to go to the doctor. It is important to drink lots of water. It's a good idea to take cough drops. Okay, thank you for the students that they sent me a text through the class. So I know that you are just listening the class, okay? Don't worry, just I wanna, um, just I wanna uh, ask something to you when you when you listen your your name, please don't forget to say uh, present, even if you are listener. O sea, si son, incluso, verdad, si son oyentes, por favor, no se olvide decir, pues, eh, present, ¿verdad? Vaya muy bien, entonces, eh, retomando el tema, ajá. What is an infinity complement, guys? What is an infinity complement? ¿Qué significan los infinity? Vamos a ver quién sabe. Who knows? Uh, the verb without conjunction. Without... Uh, the verb? Conjunction. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh -huh. Uh-huh. Okay, excellent. Also, if you notice, uh, ahí dice, ¿verdad? If you say... Uh-huh. To, uh -huh. to, to, uh -huh. to take. Uh-huh. Yeah. Excellent, Edmundo. Thank you. Excellent. Pretty nice. Welcome. Okay, Good yes. Job. Is when you add something to the verb. And that means to. Ah, to get, to eat. To take some vitamins, for example, it's important to get a lot of rest. Okay, it's sometimes helpful to eat garlic soup. And it's a good idea to take some vitamin C. I mean, this is the advice that you can say throw to the like an uh, for example, it's like a, how can I say that one when someone it's an advice. I mean, for example, it's important to sleep well or to sleep eight hours. O sea, dormir ocho horas, right? Entonces, it's important to sleep well or eight hours. Okay, ese tú que usted ve acá, right now, man, get select this one. You say to. Lo vamos a adicionar with the verb. Sí, mire, ahí le he puesto eso. Why? Because all of this one together, they have the function of the infinity. O sea, juntos hacen la función del infinity. Si usted omite, you have to, or you forget it, for example. Ah, Ryos to say something like, ah, okay, this one. Okay, <clears throat> it's sometimes helpful to... It's sometimes helpful to drink a lot of water. Ok, estamos dando, ok. Y a veces es ayuda, ¿verdad? Tomar mucha agua, ¿verdad? 
ok, entonces esto es like, I mean, this is like a, the advice for the, for the, like a, when you say, ah, it's important, ah, it's something, it's good idea, ok, pero usted debe de incluir o decir to plus a verb, ok, eso, a eso se le llama infinity complements. Okay, because you, because they say, what should you do for a call? O sea, es como aquel consejo que estamos pidiendo, ¿verdad? ¿Qué debería de hacer yo? Okay, I have fever. What I should, what else should I do? Dígame usted. Uh -huh. you, you have fever, uh, it's important to... To get uh, some pills, maybe. Aha, uh -huh. it's important to get some pills. Or oh, it's important to... To, to go, go to the doctor. Go to the doctor or to average the temperature, right? Okay, it's important to monitor the temperature because if I have fever, right? And if it is, it's important to go to a doctor. Okay, entonces, excellent. Muy bien. So, don't forget it because this is like, when, okay, y teacher, y eso, what is symbol? Porque está como en negrita o más remarcado. Porque ese es el complemento de lo que usted dice. Por eso dice, infinity complements. It's important too. It's sometimes helpful too. Y luego vamos con el verbo. O sea, acá lo que no debe de olvidar es que tú siempre va a llevar un verbo next to the two. And then what should do for a call. Ok. <coughs> Entonces, usted dice todo esto, ¿verdad? Y luego tenemos algo muy importante. Acá, look at these health problems. Just Several pieces of good advice for each problem. Ok, ya casi es tiempo. Voy a pasar los dos minutos antes para que hagamos tranquilo el exercise. But for a while, I'm going to pass the attendance list. Just give me one second because right now I'm going to pass the attendance list. Ok, <clears throat> please say present porque si no les queda el ahí el. Adán Iglesias. Present teacher, I am Thank here. You. Arles Ernesto López. Arles Ernesto López. Baudilio Elenilson Rivera Ramírez. Good evening, teacher. I am here. Good evening. Thank you. Carlos Alberto Santos Reyes. Present, teacher. Thank you. Carlos Edgardo Cruz González. Present, teacher. Thank you. Edith Consuelo Represa Toledos. Present, eh, teacher. Thank you. Eh, vamos con David Antonio Rosales García. Present, teacher. Edmundo Antonio Martínez Lucha. Present, teacher. Enrique Pérez Lemos. Enrique Pérez Lemos. Erika Beatriz Guillén Pineda. Ever Enrique Gallegos Mejía. Presidente, teacher. Thank you. Ever Francis A. Aballero. Presidente, teacher. Ever Francis Alvallero. Alvallero, sí. <laughs> ok, sorry, thank you. Franklin de la O, Ayala Hernández. Present, teacher. Thank you. Herbert Arisides Oya Ruiz. Thank you. José Amilcar Reyes Cruz. Present, teacher. José Benjamín Gavidia Guevara. Present, teacher. Juan Carlos Portillo Arias. Presente, presente, teacher, presente. Juan Francisco Arras, Arrazabal Calderón. Juan Francisco eh, Arras. 
Tiene problemas con conexión, teacher. Ah, ok. Vaya. Igual, igual el señor Pérez Lemus. Pérez Lemus. Ay, yo. Oh, ya. Yo sí me lograba conectar, pero me sacó, pero me volví a meter. Vaya, entonces le voy a poner, uy, le voy a poner acá la asistencia porque si no me responden, yo hago de caso, ¿verdad? Y les pongo la inasistencia. Y ahí sí estamos en problemas porque pues ya le puse la inasistencia, ¿verdad? Muy bien. Continúa entonces. María Magdalena Cedillos González. Sí. Good evening. Mónica Ivet Merino Rivera. Mónica Ivet. Rivas, perdón, presen. Mónica Merino Rivas. Ajá. Mónica Ivet Merino Rivas. Ok, thank you. Santos Mauricio Arias Valle. Santos Mauricio. Present teacher. Thank you. Present teacher, Saúl... present. Ok, thank you. Saúl Ernesto Martínez Portillo. Saúl Ernesto Martínez Portillo. Wilber Rafael Rivas Arias. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Excellent. Good, good attendance. Just three. Solo tengo tres que no están, pero estamos bastante bien. Thank you. Sir teacher. Yes. Francisco Razal, que no podía entrar. Ay, ¿no? Francisco. Muy bien. Quiero ver, Francisco, si me le, le puse la inasistencia. Creo que se la puso. No, 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 no. Le puse su asistencia. Sí, a los, que, los que no tienen asistencia son Arles Ernesto López, que no, no sé, no, no sé, no, no hay. Nadie... El invisible debe ser invisible. Vaya. Excuse me, teacher. Este, okay. El señor uh, Arles está incapacitado por, por lo de la garganta. Tiene una infección. Ah, vaya, pero igual, entonces sí toca en asistencia. Erika Beatriz Guillén Pineda, también, no sé si Erika. Ay, Erika, ya le había puesto la inasistencia. Es visible. Ya me ha llamado. Cuando... Ah, ok, perfecto. Y Enrique Pérez Lemo sigue teniendo... Eh, el... Ay, 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 ya, 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 Vaya. Y también eh, la otra persona que tiene inasistencia es Saúl Ernesto Martínez Portillo. Debe de ir en camino, eh, conduciendo, por eso debe tener algún inconveniente. Tal vez se conecta más tarde. Vaya, ajá, si se conecta, ¿verdad? Entonces acá le cambiamos la inasistencia porque sí es bien importante. Ahorita ya solo me queda Arles y Saúl Ernesto con inasistencia. Muchas gracias. And we are going to return to our class for today. And we have to continue with our presentation. Ok. Ahí está Saúl. Ok, Saúl, vamos a ver. Thank you. Pareció. <ríe> ok, Saúl, le vamos a quitarle una asistencia. Sí, es que creo que tiene problemas igual como de conexión, algo así. Vaya, perfecto. Entonces, I am ya... here, teacher. Okay. Arles Ernesto. Arles Ernesto. Arles Ernesto. Ok, Arles Ernesto, thank you. Today is completely. Yes, we are complete. Good attendance. Excelente. Muy bonita la asistencia del día de ahora. Congratulations to all of you. I know that you have to put your effort because it's impossible to do to turn us to every single class for any or one reason. Okay, guys. So, we are going to, for example, says, look at this health problem and choose a several piece ¿Se ve la pantallita? Sorry, I'm going to ask you. Yes, teacher. Okay. Yes, teacher. Thank you. Have problems and choose the several pieces of cute advice for each problem. Okay, let's see. Problems. What is the problems? Problem all of this uh, that you have to uh, see on your screen. That's one to eight. This is a problem, okay? Those or that ones are problems. And all of this one are the advice. Cuando usted tiene un problema, ¿por qué lo cuenta? Why you have to tell to another person your problem? What do you need? Or what do you want? Perdón. I need un consejo o una recomendación. 
a recommendation, advice, right? Yes, y siempre, ¿verdad? Estamos ahí como que, ah, necesito un consejo. Necesito un consejo o a lo mejor, ¿verdad? Estamos solicitando y ¿qué puedo hacer, verdad? Y si lo contamos, sabemos que alguien más puede ayudarnos o dar un comentario que sea en gran manera, pues, on a positive way y que podamos salir a una solución, ¿ok? We try to hear any solution. Ok, for example, dice a sore throat, como el compañero ya que, nos, que le dolió la garganta. Ah, a sore throat. Ajá. ¿Qué le vamos a recomendar? Sí, a doctor. Sí, a doctor. Let her Let her see. Letter C. Vamos a ver. Drink a lot of liquid, liquids. Mm -hmm. No. ¿Qué podemos recomendarle? Vamos a ver, aquí tengo la flechita. Ok, vamos a ver. Leamos todas las opciones. Va, o sea, por la number one. Y leemos cuál sería la mejor. The best. Number one. A sore throat. Take some vitamin C. Put some on, ointment on it. Or drink a lot of, liquid, of liquids. Or go to bed and rest, or put a body in part of it, or put it under cold water, or taste some aspirin, or see a dentist, or see a doctor, or get some medicine. Get some see medicine. And see a doctor, porque la sore throat ya es algo serio. Muy bien. A cough. Yes. ¿Qué es el cough? ¿Qué puedo hacer con el calf? ¿Qué está ahí? Calf, lo siento. Calf, calf. ¿Qué puedo hacer con eso? Estoy... Calf. Get some medicine. Get some medicine? Yes, get some yeah. medicine. Now I have a backage. Oh my God, I have a backage today. Go to bed and rest. Maybe. Go to bed and rest. Backage. What is a backage, guy? Dolor de espalda. Yes, thank you. A fever. Oh my God, I have a fever. Mm. Take some aspirin. Drink a lot of liquids. Oh, okay. drink a lot of liquids. Uh -huh. yeah. Necesito rehydrate my body. Hidratar mi cuerpo. Okay, la vamos a hacer así. Uh Okay, okay. Oh my God, I have a okay. Oh. See a dentist. See a dentist. Excellent. See a dentist. See a dentist. It's an emergency. I have to see a dentist. Okay. I'm born. I make me. I'm born myself. Uh huh. Put it under the cold water. Bad headache. Bad headache. Put it under the cold water. Lo puedo poner en, en, en el agua fría porque me quemé. Mm -mm. Put some ointment on it. Put some ointment on it. ¿Qué serán ointment? Ointment. Ajá, muy bien. Ok, and Ornament. the final. The flu. ¿Qué puedo hacer con the flu? Take some vitamin. Vitamin C. Ajá. Say some vitamin C. Ok, si usted se fija, acá tenemos, this is the problem and this is the advice. Ok, todo lo, ok, ajá, para todo lo que acá tengo, o sea, para every single problem, I have an advice or solution. Ok, excellent. Let's continue, guys. Thank you for your participation. Now it says, take about your problem in part e and give it some advice. What other advice do you have? For example, what should do for a sore throat? Uh -huh. It's a good idea to get some medicine from the drugstore. And yes, it is important to drink a lot of liquids. And ¿Qué más? ¿Qué podemos recomendar también cuando hay? Okay, what should do for a sore throat? ¿Qué ustedes más deberían de hacer? Uh -huh. Y acá nos da, it's is, good it, idea. Is, it a, is it a good idea to put on 
Onion. Onion. Uh -huh. Onion. Uh -huh. On the uh, neck, uh, right? Uh -huh. yeah. On the neck. Excellent. On the neck, yeah. yes. Like Big Baparu, right? It's yeah. not on a man. Excellent. Thank you. Okay. And uh, luego, a ver, vamos a ver. What should do? What should you do for a headache? For a headache. For a headache. Oh my God, my head. What should you do for a headache? ¿Qué debería hacer usted porque le duele la cabeza? ¿Qué? ¿Qué, qué hacemos? What we have to do? It's good idea to get to... Some pills. Some pills. To get some pills. Or some aspirin, right? Yes. Yeah. Excellent. What should you do for a toque? Uh -huh. Toque. It's important to go to, go to the dentist. It's important to go to the dentist. But for a while, pero para mientras, porque no hay un doctor cerca y ya me duele demasiado. Uh -huh. Alcohol. Alcohol. Uh -huh. Alcohol. Yeah. Alcohol. Okay, yeah. you, it's good idea too. Good alcohol, dice el mundo, ¿verdad? Muy bien. O también, it's good idea. Anest uh -huh. Anesthetic. Anesthesia. Yes, anesthesia. Anesthesia. Okay, también, it's good idea, it's good idea to get some pills, ¿verdad? Hay pastillas para dolor fuerte. Entonces, it's good idea. Okay, muy bien. Excellent. Well, okay. Now you have to write an advance for the problems that you will use this advance in exercise for. Okay, como le hemos hecho acá, usted va a hacer un problemita. ¿Qué quiere decir? Que usted va a hacer ese problemita, ¿verdad? Y, perdón. Espérame que se me bajó. Ok, sí. Va. Muy bien. Entonces, ¿qué es lo que vamos a hacer? Como usted ya vio, ¿verdad? Ya, ya, ya escuchó. Usted, ya estuvimos practicando. Entonces, ¿qué es lo que va a hacer? Ahora usted va a hacer write an advance, o sea, va a escribir el problem y el advance como está aquí. Bien. What should I do uh, for, for a call? It's a good idea to get, y va a utilizar el to get, it's a good idea to get some son medicines, o sea, tomar algunas medicinas. Usted va a usar uno de esos. O si usted tiene un sore muscle, ¿qué es lo que debe de hacer? Entonces, va a escribir ahorita el problem y la solution, ¿sí? Como está acá. Le voy a dar tres minutos para que lo escriba. In three, no, cuatro, tres. Yo creo que en tres lo han terminado. Porque solo quiero el problem y la solution. Here we go.
Ok, guys, it's a Miss Server. Por ahí vi unos del mundo. Excelente el mundo. Muy bien, pero lo vamos a mencionar. <coughs> ok, voy a empezar con el mundo. <laughs> Okay, Edmundo. Okay, okay. Tell us. Okay. Uh, what should uh, what should what should what should you do for a sambar? It is important to put ornament on it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The Excellent. second, what should what should you do for sore eyes? It's good to put eye drops. Uh -huh. Excellent, good, thank you. Jose Benjamin, what is your... What should you do for sore age? It's good easy to head age droop. Age droop, excellent. Thank you. Okay, muy bien, thank you. Let's see, <clears throat> Maria Magdalena, me avisan si pueden participar, ¿verdad? si no, pues yo paso, next. Porque maybe you are busy. A lo mejor están busy, ocupados. Ok, eh, María Magdalena, what is your problem and solution? No? Ok, José Amilcar. José Amilcar. Tell me, teacher. Ok, what is your problem and what is your recommendation too? Um, oh my God, I have a bad headache. Ok. Um, take a two a uh, ceraminophen. It's a good idea to take a ceraminophen. Okay, thank you, Jose Milcar. And Wilber, what about you, Wilber? What should do you from a stomach? Mm -hmm. It's a good idea to get some um, um pecto small. Ok, perfecto, Bismol, muy bien. Excelente, Alcácer, se dice. Muy bien, too. Ok, David Antonio Rosales, what is your problem and your recommendation, too? David, no. David. No, vaya. Muy bien. Another volunteer who wants to participate. Teacher. Yes. Uh, Enrique, tell us. Yeah. Um, that, that should you do for um, a sort of that. It is a good year to get some take it up of Cinnamon. Cinnamon. Okay. Cinnamon. Tere canela. Uh -huh. Sí, cinnamon. Excellent. Good. Thank you. Another participant? Otra participante? Yes, tenga? teacher. Okay. Thank you. What should do you for uh, insomnia? Insomnia. Uh -huh. Muy bien. Uh, it's a good idea to get some, some tea. Some tea. Excellent. Some tea. Excellent. Okay, muy bien. If you notice, we are going to read this one that is pronunciations, reduction of two. Listen and practice. In conversation, two is often reduced to. Okay, what should, what should you do for a fever? It's important to take some aspirin and a good idea to see a doctor. Okay, if you notice, so in conversation, two is often reduced to reduce to. Okay, for example, what should you do for a fever? It's important to take some aspirin. And it's a good idea to see a doctor. See? The pronoun uh, this exercise is emphasized in pronunciation. For example, and then says, look back at the bar of C of exercise three and ask for a key and advice about for each help problem. Pay attention to the pronunciation of two. Okay, here we have, just give me one second because I need to check that we are going to have this. This is for, I mean, for example, 
we are going to watch a video on we are going to study about suggests. Okay, right now. One second. Here we go. Okay. Hi, ready to begin? In the conversation we're about to listen to, we will introduce modal verbs for suggestions and requests. Please practice the conversation with a classmate or a friend, as it is important to repeat for better understanding. Listen and practice. Hi. May I help you? Yes, please. Could I have something for a cough? I think I'm getting a cold. Well, I suggest a box of these cough drops. Thank you. And what do you suggest for dry skin? Try some of this new lotion. It's very good. Okay. And one more thing. My husband has no energy these days. Can you suggest anything? He should try some of these multivitamins. They're excellent. Great. May I have three large bottles, please? We are going to listen for the second time y después lo vamos a Permítanme, uy, ¿qué le pasó a esto? Okay, for example, if you notice a day, they search a suggestion, okay? Buscan una suggestion. Mm, give me one second. Vamos a ver, bueno, vamos a continuar con nuestro book y después retornamos acá. Ok. ¿Qué es la conversación que tenemos por acá? Y right now lo que vamos a hacer es, uh, you are going to practice with this one. And after that, you have to practice, you have to uh, participate. So you have... Five minutes, no, four minutes to practice. Cuatro minutos para que practique. Cierro el micrófono, como usted sabe, ¿verdad? Y usted lo repite ahí donde está porque lo voy a poner con alguien más, ¿ok? With your classmate, ¿ok? Y así lo vamos a ir desarrollando. Muy bien. Here we go.
Okay, the time is over, guys. Right now we are going to start. Okay, Wilbur, start you and then continue Jose Benjamin. Okay. Hi, Mai. I heard you. Yes, please call. I have some time for a coach. I drink. I have a good. Okay, continue. Edmundo. Acá. Well, I suggest. Eh, está con microfonito apagado, Edmundo. Oh, so, well, I suggest a box of these cough drops. Thank you. Edith, continue. Okay. Try you. And what do you? Sugar for three skin. Continue, David Antonio. Try some of this new lotion. It's very good. Thank you. Continue. La camarita, la camarita, please. Turn on. Vamos a ver. Enrique, continue. Yeah. Sería Mr. Webb. Yes. Oh, and one more thing. My husband has no energy this. This day, can you suggest anything? Thank you. Continue. Yes. yes. Ah, vaya. Perfecto, mi niña. No se preocupe. Ok. Claro, vea, si no pueden, no la pongan, pero si alguien más puede, ¿verdad? Ahí sí lo debemos de, de poner porque acá, aquí es donde yo me baso para que ustedes puedan participar y si no, pues siempre participamos los que tienen camarita encendida. Va vale, muy bien. Ok, thank you. Bueno, continuamos entonces y me ayuda entonces a quien... Enrique. Aquí, Enrique. Kishu. Uh, she should try some of this uh, multivitamins. They are excellent. Excellent. And finally, Edmundo. Great. Uh, may I have three, uh, three large bottles, please? Okay. Excellent. Muy bien. Bueno. Vamos a desarrollar en this part. For example, esto era como lo que estábamos realizando. Que okay, dice, what do you do when you feel very stressed? You have a, an argument with a friend and it's 2 a.m. and it's can sleep some standing near your faint. You need to study, but you can concentrate. Ok, ajá, ya escuchamos, mire. What do you do when, y luego empezamos a relatar, ¿verdad? Dice, ok, what do you do when you feel very stressed? Ok, es una question para usted, así, in personal opinion. What do you do when you feel stressed? When you feel very stressed. Mm -hmm. What did you do? Mm. I, I do exercise. Okay, Did you... you do exercise, very good. What else? Que más? Maybe you read a book. Maybe mm. you listen to music. No. Mm -hmm. I, okay. I, I, I listen to music. You listen to music, excellent. Muy bien, bueno. Vamos a continuar. Ok, entonces, pero ¿qué nos dice acá? I think that it's important to breathe deeply. ¿Verdad? Breathe deeply. Yes, it is sometimes helpful too. Ok, cuando estamos very stressful, right? Very, 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 very stressful. Sabemos que eso es lo que tenemos que hacer, ¿verdad? Muy bien, bueno. Luego dice, how any, any of about situation happen you, to you recently and share what did you with the class, okay? 
Muy bien. Entonces, ¿qué es lo que nos dice? Have you any about this situation? Yes, the majority, right? Happened you recently? Could be, podría ser, ¿verdad? Could be that you feel very stressful and when you feel like this, just you say, okay, uh, I think that it's important maybe to take some maybe vitamins for to reduce the stress, right? Podría ser que yo pienso que es importante tomar algunas medicinas, vitaminas, perdón, para reducir un poco el estrés, ¿verdad? Que hoy dicen, bueno, ok, if you take vitamins, you can uh, reduce your stress, it's going to be less, because it, maybe you, you feel uh, less stress in your body. O sea, y si usted toma esas vitaminas, se puede sentir con menos estrés en el cuerpo, ¿verdad? es lo que nos dicen. Okay, but, but I think that it's okay that you have to take some vitamins because it can be reduced to feel stress, stressful, right? Estresado. Okay, muy bien. And now we are going to say this one and says use the words in the list and complete expression and then compare with a partner. For example, bag, bottle, boss, can, jar, pack, stick, and chew. Ok, what do you think in this one? ¿Qué ve usted en esta, en este, en, in this uh, screen? In this screen, what do you see? Defaulting a, a wall. Ajá, uh -huh, muy bien. But you can see a lot of things that we can use when we have a, a what? A uh, uh, toothpaste. Ajá, y vemos muchas cosas que las utilizamos cuando qué? When we have, uh, we have, uh, we, we, uh, we, when we, we are, uh, we have, or we have an illness, or we, we have a problem. Ajá, muy bien. When we have um, any illness or disease, or maybe mm -hmm. also they, you can use this one, for example, for toothpaste, you can use for your health, right? For your clean your, maybe your mouth, brush your teeth. So, I mean, some of that thing is going to be helpful for you when you uh, get a disease or maybe for clean your body or to have a personal care. Que cuidados personales. Okay, mm. let's see. Yes. Num number one. For example, in number one, ¿será que podemos decir a jar of toothpaste? No, no, no. a tube. A tube. A tube. Excellent. A tube. Okay, a tube. Let's see, two. Two. Okay, two. muy bien. Yeah. Two. Two. Number two, uh, Bob scan bottle bag pack stick a tube. Stick. Tag. Very good. What does mean a stick? Los stickers. No. Stick. Like a blister. Blister. Number yeah. three. Bag. Pack. Bag. Of bandage, bandage. ¿Qué son bandage? bandage benditas. Vendas, vendas. Ajá, sería, ben. sería pack. 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 O, 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 o box. O box. O box. O box. Box. Yes. box. 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 And number four of shaving a cream. It's a tube. Two. Can. Spray. Is that? Can. No, can. Can. It's a can. Can, can. Can es como los aerosoles. Okay. Can. Uh, una, la, una lata. Pero, pero ese no es aerosol, lata. es espuma, no. Bueno. Lata, sí, pero vienen en el mismo eh, eh, sí. lata que vienen envasados los aerosoles, las espumas. O sea, las espumas para, para Chevy. Ok, number five. ¿Qué significa of tissues? Tissues. Mm, no Vendas. No. No, no, tissues. 
Busquémoslo, por favor, please. Tejidos. No. Pa son pañuelos. Jesus. Ajá, yes, ahí son dijeron. To toallitas, ajá. Son toallitas, pañuelos, ajá. casos Kleenex. Excelente. Entonces, ¿qué podemos decir que es? Is a bottle yes. bag. Is a box. 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 Pues, box or pack. 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 Muy bien. Next one. Next one. Bottle. Bottle. Pack. Bottle. Bottle. Muy bien. Bottle. O face cream. Okay, of ice cream. And number seven, a cup of chop. Is a can. Can. No. Can. ¿Qué significa cough drops? Tablet. Gotas, gotas para la para la tos. Ajá. Cough drops. Ajá, ¿qué podría ser? Bottle. 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 Muy bien. Now, ah, ¿te recuerdas que te duele el dedo? Uh, teacher, is... excuse yes? me, one question. Yes. Um, I can es similar a, a poder y, y se Ajá. escribe similar. ¿Sí o no? Sí. Se escriben iguales, miren, pero no, ¿verdad? Pero no es que de poder, sino que se está refiriendo al can de la. Como la sardina, vaya. La sardina viene de una can. Vaya, qué bonito. Ajá, hay que tener cuidado. Hay que tener cuidado. Vaya, qué chido. Y el micrófono gallego. Le cuide el dedito allá. Thank you, gracias. Muy bien. Eh, muy bien. Entonces, luego tenemos, ¿verdad? La eh, conversation que habíamos estado practicando. Y acá está. Muy bien. Bueno, rápidamente, pero nos falta acá una cosita. Dice, what is your more things that you can buy in each con of the in each of the container above? What is the more things that you can buy in each of the container above? ¿Qué es lo que usted puede comprar in each of the container above? De todas estas. Creo que todas, ¿verdad? We can use toothpaste, we can you buy toothpaste, we can use we can buy a also can of the desodorant, okay? Yes, but not muchas, okay, a lot of this one. You can buy a bag of a brief mint, excellent. Verdad que sabe, sometimes, creo que sí. Luego el dibujito que se parece. Bueno, y acá tenemos la suggestion que ha sido pues lo que hemos estado viendo. Ok, vamos con lo siguiente. Models, necesito que, bueno, creo yo que logramos ver un video that is about models. ¿Qué pasó? ¿Qué quieres? Give me one second. Un micrófono, my Ok, this one. Here we go. Hello everyone, this time we will be introduced to the modal verbs can, could, may for suggestions and requests. Modal verbs can, could, may for requests. Suggestions. Can I help you? May I help you? Can I have a box of cough drops? Could I have something for a cough? May I have a bottle of aspirin? What do you suggest for dry skin? What do you have for dry skin? Try some of this lotion. I suggest some ointment. You should get some skin cream. In this case, can, 
could and may are being used in question form to suggest or give advice. This is how we use them. Model verb plus subject plus verb have plus complement plus question mark. Can I have eye drops? May I have an ointment? Could I have some aspirins? What I want you to do now is to write a sentence using each modal verb learned. Please write them in our discussion box. Okay guys, this one says grammar facts. Modal verbs can pull may for request suggestion may can, may, cool, or may. Okay, may. May I help you? ¿Verdad? May I help you? O can I help you? ¿Puedo ayudarte? Can I have a box of cough drop? Okay. No, ¿verdad? Puedo tener. Okay. Request. Request. O sea, algo, un requisito. O sea, soy, que estoy solicitando, ¿verdad? Okay. Could I have Could I have something for a cold? Podría obtener o tener algo para la cough, for a cough, cough. May I have, okay? Podría tener un bote de aspirinas, okay? Me podría dar un bote de aspirinas, ¿sí? Cuando vamos a la farmacy, okay? May I have a bottle of aspirin? May I have a bottle of acetaminophen? Okay, excellent. Entonces, uh, aquí vamos a utilizar los models in order to practice con el objetivo de practicar the suggestion. For example, when you mention can, may, and cool. Okay. What do you suggest have for dry skin? Okay. ¿Qué me puede sugerir para piel? Seca, ¿verdad? Ok, luego tenemos por acá. Dice, complete this conversation with the verbs can, cool, and may have, and have, try, suggest, or should, and then compare with a partner. For example, ¿qué puede ser in number one? Okay. Number, can I help can you? I, can I help you? Can I help you? Excellent. ¿Qué respondo? Yes. 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 Mm. Yes. Yes, I have something for each eyes, okay? Uh -huh. Yes, may I have something for each eye? Each eyes. ¿Pero qué voy a preguntar? Okay, yes. Acá respondo. Mm -hmm. Yes, punto. Ok. May I have something for its eyes? Sure. Ajá. Uh -huh. Sure qué? Sure. Uh, sure. I have a bottle. I have. Muy bien. Hey, thank you. Number two. What do you? What do you have for some muscles? Excellent. Okay, number three. Could I have? And what do you? You what could do you? What did you have for mm -hmm. insomnia? ¿Qué le digo? I suggest some of these herbal. Herbal. Suggest.
Ok, ahí tenemos. I suggest, ¿verdad? Muy bien. Y aquí estamos empleando cada uno de los modal verbs. All of these ones are modal verbs because you can use for as something maybe that you need, but in polite way. Ok, y eso lo utilizamos cuando estamos hablando in polite way. Ok. Just in that case, solo en ese caso, ¿verdad? Y que, I mean, this one is very, 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 very politely. Okay, guys. So, let's gonna be. Stop here and. Don't forget, you can free your platform and thank you for your assistance on this day okay have a beautiful night take care see you next week have a beautiful night bye bye take care bye guys good night bye bye teacher, teacher. Good night. see you tomorrow nos vemos grupo hasta mañana ah, no hasta el lunes